Ad fraud uh, very simply causes the ad dollars to be wasted because if the display ad or video ad is shown to a bot instead of a human, the bot's never going to turn into a customer. So obviously those ad uh, dollars are wasted. But there's a more nuanced uh, implication to that because the bots are creating fake traffic, fake impressions, and fake clicks. It also messes up the analytics. So when you're seeing higher click-through rate and you can't scrub the bots, you might actually be sending more money to the sites that show you higher click-through rate due to bot activity, not due to more interest in your product. So the impact on analytics is also where I focus to help uh, clean up the bot activity. So therefore, we have clean analytics to actually do our measurements. If you're talking about GRPs as a common metric between offline and online, I don't think those are, that's a good idea. The reason for that is offline is good for awareness, meaning TV. Uh, but online, digital is inherently a two-way channel, and so it is more measurable and you can use it for direct response. So it should be something complementary to TV as opposed to something that's the same as TV. So even though we have video ads, yes, you're trying to get reach and frequency from it, but uh, ideally you can look for the click-throughs and the, some kind of follow-on action that is more directionally indicative of your conversion. I'm doing a session tomorrow, it's mainly for the publishers, and these are the ones selling the ads. These are good publishers, and it's really about how they avoid uh, getting into that trap of, of ad fraud. Because sometimes it becomes very attractive or, um, or easy to start buying traffic to start to grow your ad revenue. But I don't see any scenario in which source traffic is a good thing. Because basically there aren't a whole bunch of humans sitting around with nothing to do but to go to websites. So when you buy traffic, they make all that traffic using bots. So really, you know, uh, for the good publishers is really stay away from the exchanges, stay away from those kind of unscrupulous practices where they're just growing their ad revenue artificially quickly uh, due to buying the traffic. So if they can stay clean, uh, that's always a better longer term strategy than trying to make a quick buck, you know, uh, using fraud and bots to do it.